welcome back to another weekly vlog. This is my fifth weekly vlog now and I'm still sticking to it so I must be doing something right if I've been managed to be able to keep up with all the weekly vlogs and stuff but today is Monday the 29th of November. We are literally at the end of November which is making me so excited for Christmas. Like it, to be honest, my mum has already put quite a lot of Christmas decorations up. We get a real Christmas tree every year and I think this week they are maybe going to be getting a Christmas tree. So I am excited. I have to put up in my little Christmas house. <laughs> I got it from Palmland, it's pretty cute. The only thing is it just leave a lot of glitter on your hands and I am I am actually in Scott's sweatshirt again because I'm not going to lie to you guys, I literally live in this at the moment. It's so comfortable, I love it so much, but I'm going to show you something because yesterday in Cumbria and in other parts of England, it was snowing yesterday and there's still a bit of snow left where I live, so I'm going to show you what it's like. As you can see, this is by my window and then that is the snow over there like oh my god it has been snowing the sky is so white like it is so white <laughs> so yeah it's pretty christmasy right now but as you can probably tell in my skin is spotty as anything it is a time of the month type thing i'm sure a lot of women it will be able to relate with me right now i'm feeling a bit moody and stuff and just a bit lazy you know and i need to do you know, something about my skin so i'm going to do my skincare again i never do my skincare on the morning usually i usually leave it until the night time and then i can kind of clean after like being out all day doing things you know i think i'm gonna have to keep on top of my skin because i'm not gonna lie i am pretty lazy with doing skincare and stuff i don't have the effort is all done oh my god in my skin look so pink now after that but you know at least the blood under the skin has the rust underneath the skin surface and it'll help heal all the spots but that's why i love using the default spin brush i just sent me this like a little while ago and i have actually been using it continuously ever since i sent me it honestly i love it so definitely have a look on the default website because it's really good stuff this isn't an ad or anything it worked with the brand before and i love them you know but yeah my skin just feels so much better now and i think i am still going to put some makeup on um i just because the skin yeah it's looking very spotty everywhere now at the moment like i don't know what's going on i've just been eating too much chocolate and that it makes your skin break out a lot, but oh well, it's fine. <laughs> I've got some makeup on. I honestly feel so much better for having this makeup on now. I look very glowy today, but I'm kind of feeling really glowy. The makeup, the kind of look, and I don't have any eyelashes on because I really don't I want to be pulling out my natural eyelashes again. Because you can tell, I barely have any. But anyway, so in my mum's final Christmas present arrived last week and now i am going to show you what has actually arrived i've told her not to watch any of these weeks so i'll clean up to christmas because i do kind of show some christmas presents in them but i've actually got her a country file calendar i've never actually bought her a country file advent calendar before they're not advent calendar it's just a calendar but um basically I tried talking to TK Maxx because I always get her a calendar for Christmas. It's what I always get her for Christmas. Um, and TK Maxx always has some really nice ones, but 
the Bailey has new this year. So it's got actually came up with the idea and said, yeah, why don't you get her a country file one and the lovely photos and it's for children in need as well. So like it's a good cause and stuff. So I'm just going to kind of go through the photos. Like it looks so nice, like a really good quality. And it was only, it was only 9.99 free postage as well. So highly recommend getting your loved ones and stuff the calendar because honestly it's all the photos are amazing i love them literally and for a tenner i think it's amazing so look how cute the little badger is so cute it smells really nice do you know when you get a new book or something and like it just has that a really nice smell to it it actually smells so nice i love that one as well yeah, that's probably one of my favourites actually. Yeah, this one's cute as well. Yeah, some of them almost look like a painting. They're like yeah, these ones here. Yeah, look how good that is. That one's cool. And then how many is left? October. This is November. And then we finally have December. December. Yeah, that one. Yeah, so I'm sure it's just going to be chuffed with that and I think I'm going to wrap it up for her probably later on you when know, I come home from work today. So yeah, yeah, that's what I've got my mother for Christmas. I've literally yeah, basically wrapped all of my presents now. I'm just going to make myself a barbecue chicken pizza. I mean, it's pretty easy to make. It's just basically putting yeah, the chicken onto here. But I've got a little pizza and... A little barbecue chicken i love barbecue chicken so much so i'm just gonna you know add it on and it's but nicer than having like a proper just a margarita pizza or pepperoni you know, always have pepperoni for lunch and like it gets a bit boring sometimes so like it's nice to actually have something different but yeah i'm just gonna make this i'm now home here from work guys and i've come home to the box of roses yeah, my mum said yeah, because she has not got me like an advent calendar yeah, this year she thought she'd get me a box of roses honestly these are top tier yeah, these and equality streets are the best I don't even argue like the celebrations are probably some of the worst the heroes are a bit the same but these are just another level strawberry creams are the best honestly absolutely obsessed with them yeah, these are probably gonna last me and more stuff around I don't even know, probably a week. Who knows? I'll try to be sensible anyway. But yeah. yeah my mum knows how much I love my strawberry creams especially and the roses are absolutely beautiful. So yeah, I am chuffed a bit. Literally just lit this absolutely beautiful candle again. <laughs> I literally talk about this all the time, but all oh my days. And to be honest, candles are my favourite things at the moment. Three or four years ago, I used to be obsessed with wax melts, but candles really do hit differently these days, guys. Like this one, I think it's because I'm feeling really Christmassy this year, and because we have our decorations up in the house and stuff, and this scent it just reminds me of Christmas, and it it makes me feel really happy, and that is why I love burning this candle. So if you're wanting to get a Christmassy candle and you love the smell of gingerbread. Oh my god, get this because when you burn it, you feel as if you're in a gingerbread shop. It's that nice. I've also been delving into my roses. Oh my god, I am so happy, Mum. It got me these. I've not had a lot. I've just had a few. I'm trying to be sensible with how much chocolate I eat because I am aware it does make my skin break out a lot. Oh my god, why won't it open? <laughs> it, when you only have one hand because you're vlogging. <laughs> A vlog in life but yeah these are amazing and look how pretty they look in the packaging however and look at how much packaging they're wasting you know the chocolate it goes up to there and that's like all the wasted packaging there they're very bad but i'm not complaining because they're, they're good things oh my god please ex excuse my feet and and stuff my toenails are actually horrendous underneath oh yeah and also i've got this weird like this scabby thing on my leg right and it's really itchy before it rashed over 
I was itching it for ages and I've stopped because it's causing more of a rash. I've not it waxed my legs in ages, like it can't be waxing because I've not it waxed them in about like a month and a half. I literally have no hairs on my legs now, guys. It's so weird. But it's like it's got like blood spots in it and stuff. Can anybody recommend me something to kind of put on it to kind of make it go away? Because it's been on here for ages. But and my dad did say yeah, that he just gets, well, he used to get them a lot at my age. So it could just be like a genetic thing. I've inherited you know, my bumpy fingernails from my mum and then you know, my spotty skin and you know, the rashes on my legs from my dad. <laughs> yeah, what a lovely combo. But yeah, I'm going to get a drink and I might as well show you guys the Christmas lights on the stairs um, because they are super cute. Oh my God. You know, the light in this room on night time is so dark. I, I need to put in my little fairy lights on, but this is a current state of my room. But so here are the first ones. Look how cute they are. Look. And then the other ones are on the main stairs. How cute are they? Feels so Christmassy. They look so cute. Oh, oh yeah, and then the other reef over here as well. How cute is that? Oh, it's so pretty. Yeah, very Christmassy. It is now Tuesday and it is in the morning, obviously. I I feel so tired. Like, oh my God. I woke up at eight o'clock and oh my God, I feel I need a big stretch. Oh. Yeah, so I woke up at eight o'clock. I had a shower and stuff, I had my breakfast, I had a muffin for breakfast instead of chocolate, so I'm actually getting somewhere in life now, <laughs> by actually having something substantial for breakfast, you know, makes a change. I have honestly had two, it was just myself from having these, like, oh my god, they're so nice, but yeah, so I am actually listening out for parcels because I actually have the one parcel coming from a brand which i need to to come today i mean um otherwise yeah, there's a chance of him sending it at the back so it needs to come today or arrive when if someone is at home i'm actually the only person in the house at the moment so yeah and i'm probably the deafest person in the house as well because if you don't know ever since i was a child i've had a lot of like hearing problems and stuff and I've had to go to, is it called audiology or something? Don't actually go there anymore, but I don't have the best hearing. So it's a fun fact if you didn't you know about me, and now you know something interesting about me. It, it's not really interesting, but it's just something I've got to live with. I won't be able to hear as well as, as other people, so... That's a bit depressing, but I'm not really bothered. It doesn't make me cry. <laughs> anyway. Oh, my God. Hey, look at my slipper. Ah, oh, my God. I need some new slippers for Christmas. If I don't get bought any new slippers for Christmas, I will actually cry. Oh, my God. It was that voice break. Because I really need slippers. Yeah. Um. I don't... This morning, I really couldn't be bothered with a full face of makeup. So I guess they took my eyebrows on. I'm a mascara. No, but to be honest, my skin is looking pretty clear for me, so I'm just gonna embrace the clear skin for once. The under eyes are actually really bright, so what is going on? I don't know. Find a look alive. Guys, I have we just had the most amazing parcel arrive, as you can tell. This is from a company. I'm not we're going to be able to mention names until after the video. But how stunning is that bag? I honestly love this bag so much. It's so pretty and it's made out of real leather and stuff. Oh my God, it is beautiful. I can't stop staring at it. It is so pretty. So yeah, this is my new baby to add to my collection of handbags. You watch out for the Christmas the wish list video because you know, the features in that. It might always be uploaded before this bag has been shown this vlog but yeah it's actually stunning it's so perfect it's so beautiful obviously she's super excited to get this beautiful bag open as soon as 
you're the parcel person, you knocked on the door, I was straight to the door. So yes, I thank you to the company who have sent me this beautiful handbag, the box and everything. Oh my God, I just can't believe it. <laughs> I've just arrived, oh my God. <laughs> and Scott, oh, that is so cute. <gasps> I've been wanting the, fl the flowers or a flower for ages. Flowers, Thank you. So what's on the menu today? We're having meaty face pizza. Ooh. It's pepperoni, ham and a bit of sauce. Oh yeah, I'm excited. No, it's not, that's Mind fine. Mess, I'm moving. Oh, I guess he's moving out, guys. <laughs> because his place is a poop hole, uh, literally. And then I've got well. pizza on. Oh, yes. Down, down. Okay, wow. Well, this is, um, I think he just came in, guys. I'm I was sitting in the fridge ready. <laughs> Keeping cold. There you go, my sweetheart. Thank you. But, um, it's non alcoholic wine. A non alcoholic wine. Right, I've really just walked in and this is what I've came to. It's so cute. Oh, look at the candles. I love them. Look how cute with that. It looks. Oh, I don't want to steal that off him. Thank you. Oh, oh my god. Yeah, these are the pizzas that like, I always used to have. Thank you. <laughs> Are they both for me? No. <laughs> this music is quite fun. I dare say. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> On our way to home bargains, aren't we? You're the biggest home bargains we've ever been to once late. It is. Actually. I've been to Penrith home burgers. Is Penrith even bigger? Um, oh, are they similar? Similar size, but Whitehaven's much better. So... Big up Whitehaven, the only good thing about it. Yeah, we're going to be getting <laughs> the Santa hats, aren't we? Santa hats. Oh, it, it's Santa hats. Yeah, for Sunday. For a stall on Sunday. Because Scott is actually going to have like a stall at this event. In a barn. In a barn. So, and I'm going to be helping him out. So. If not too awkward, I might vlog that as well. Yeah. Yeah, you know. But yeah, we were on our way to Home Bargains. I'm excited because Home Bargains is like our second home, isn't it? Yeah, I'll be in there and then Home Bargains. Home yeah, bargains be there because it's as good as Home Bargains. It just takes a while to get to Home Bargains. Yeah. yeah but it's yeah. worth the 40 minute drive. 30 minute drive. Oh my god. Just it's found a mask in Home Bargains. Oh my god. It's the same size as like the actual head. Yeah, look at all them, they're so cool. Well, they're really funny, but they're hard to breathe in. Yeah, it's my asthma's playing. No. You should get that and I'll no, get thanks. I'm okay. And you, I'll wear that and you wear no, this. No, I'd rather not. Is it too much? Yeah, too much. Yeah, look what I've managed to find. The goodbyes. Goodbye. <laughs> Thank you. 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 An Olivia Hill brow gel for 99p because I've I've not had a brow gel in ages and yeah, they're a really good price and yeah, they look fairly good. I don't know where I would go in. All that stuff is falling everywhere as usual. Got a lot of good stuff in here, so I also got a candy cane bunting. If if we do, it might just get away over Christmas time. I also got a real technique brush set for 4.99 including a, a mirror and a sponge as well and then uh, three uh, brushes the pink ones were 1.99 each and then uh, that, uh, this one here was 2.49 look at that i also got uh, these clips uh, i've got some hair rollers and these are going to hold the rollers in place oh, here we go do you want to ask uh, 479p i think it was maybe 99p all right yeah, and then I also got another can. Well, a new. Oh my god, a new gingerbread handle, which I, I have at the moment. And you guys know how much I love this. This is two ninety nine. So that's all I got yeah. from the shops. <laughs> no, I love it. Yeah, it's really nice. Scotland, that's where we'll be heading. Hopefully. Scotland. Why? Hey. Behind uh, the mic here. Sorry. <laughs> it's nice and white. It is. A white wall. Have you ever there? Scotland over there? Yeah. Isn't it? Scotland's here. Yeah. yeah. Can you believe? Four ninety nine for five your makeup brushes and a sponge and a mirror. We'll see. It's alright. And then 
Either, either candle which I'm really short. I don't know. But don't you ever know that you're out? But yeah, oh, hey, look at that lovely sky and all the windmills in the background. Oh, I got driving to make me sick today. No, it's that hill. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. I've heard that story before. I've got my Santa hat on in B&M. Look at them. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> <laughs> that is so that, funny. You know what that's going to be? Yeah, probably Thumbnail. Nail, yeah. <laughs> of this weekly vlog. Oh! Hey, look at this hit me in the face. Boom. Oh, I'm taking this off. I, I know, five quid for that. Cute. Oh, no, my hair's a mess now. Yeah. Yeah. They've been to one bag. It's been to Tesco to get some bits and Christmas stuff. And now we're getting these from B&M. So, yeah. Taking Daisy out on a walk. <laughs> look, she's so crazy. Daisy, come here for you. Look at her running around. <laughs> she's a mad dog. <laughs> when she's off the lead, she'll just go absolutely crazy. I know. Look at her eyes. Hi. Oh my God. Look. <laughs> oh. I know, yeah, she's tired. It's absolutely freezing <laughs> noise, isn't it? I know. Oh, Daisy, come on then. Here. Come on, Daisy, come on. <laughs> oh, it's so cold. Hey, yo. Daisy, back. Daisy, come back. Oh, good girl. Daisy. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. It's a Monday. Merry Christmas. Right, I am now back from Scott's house. I'm in my natural habitat in my bed in my bedroom and a parcel has arrived for me for doll beauty first a doll beauty had been a lot better at delivering compared to Pia louise i have not received both of my Pia louise parcels yet so i'm hoping they'll arrive tomorrow i do have a huda beauty parcel arriving tomorrow and hopefully a beauty bear one arriving soon so it's all just makeup parcels arriving but as a lot of you may know the doll beauty did have the ten pound lucky bags, and I thought I would order a couple more for myself and for pretty business. So I've got one here, then I've also got another one. So we're gonna open them up on today. So I like being able to open them and then and not and know what's in it because it's more exciting, you know. Right. So let's open this one. I love seeing new stuff. Oh, eyelashes, Tiana. I got these in the last time, but in natural eyelashes. Imagine if I got the same things as the last one. That'd be quite funny. I've got you know, like a diamond highlighter again. I'm I'm gonna be topped up on highlighters now for like ages, so you just won't have to buy them. Then I've got two products. Oh my god, I've got a brush. I didn't even realise a doll beauty did brushes, but this is the db13 a goat hair brush oh my god i have to try the brushes out and then i've also got a lip liner i think a kiss my sass i think the shade is let's have a look and see let's have a look yeah, these are literally the worst things to open who else actually hates peeling off like this type of packaging on the lip liners and eyeliners because it's the worst it it takes forever to come off I'm mean, just chucking all the rubbish on the floor as you do, you know. Right. Yeah, I'll have to do it for now. But anyway, I see this shade it's sticking to me. Right, a lovely pinky colour. I'm really happy because last time, if you watched my last weekly vlog, I actually got a black lip liner, and I was like, oh my god, I'm already going to be using black. A lip liner on the lips? No. So I, I, I'm going to use that as an eyeliner. But that is another thing I am chuffed about. Yes, that's my lip liner that I've got. Yes, this is the first one. So first one, I've got a pair of eyelashes. I've got a full-sized highlighter, a brush and a lip liner. So I'm really happy. So let's open the next one. I'm hoping I'll get like a pair of eyelashes again because it's it always good being stocked up on eyelashes. To be quite honest with you all, it's quite a good things to get in these bundles and i think you always do get eyelashes let's see yeah and more eyelashes again tiana again also trying to get rid of these eyelashes so <laughs> i mean 
Yeah, they are very pretty eyelashes. I like them and I'll be able to use them on clients. I'm not complaining. It's still good eyelashes. Another lip liner. Kiss my sass. Is this the same oh, 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 once again? Please don't say the same ones. I think I've actually have the same again. I actually do. I'm not even joking. I literally have the cheap pockets. Are you having me on? Are you having me on? Are you having me on? Okay. Well, at first, at least I've got backups. The cubicles the eyelashes is fine. The lip liners, I don't mind. The brushes is fine. But highlighters, yeah, they're good. But still, you would have thought, oh, this person has ordered two lucky dips, so why not kind of change it up a bit and put the different products in? But clearly not. Anyway, I'm still awfully happy. For £20, I've got two highlighters which are worth £15 each that's £30 I've got two pairs of eyelashes a retail for £10 that is 50 quid. the brushes I'm not too sure on the price but let's say like £8 that is 66 the lip liners are like £8 I think again so £82 all for 20 yeah I'm happy I'm happy but it would I order two lucky dips at the same time? I don't know. It'd just be careful because that can happen sometimes. But yeah, I'm still chuffed because I've got some new stuff anyway. But yeah. Good afternoon, everybody. As you can tell, I have some makeup on. I've gone to like a smoky eye today and honestly, I am actually feeling it. I've not taken any photos because I look ugly, but <laughs> you're literally my life right now. I never take selfies anymore because I literally... It never feel nice. Can anybody else relate to that? And also, if I'm wearing masks in the shop and everything, can you see all the breakouts? It's more on this side. Yeah, it's embarrassing. I'm also waiting for another parcel. Oh my god, the last week and this week is pretty much me just waiting for parcels. But a DHL are meant to be delivering a parcel today, but when I've clicked like on the tracking it's got a red cross on it and like it, it it says exception so i googled what it, it meant and basically the holding in the parcel it's something to do with customs or something so i don't have a clue of what is going on but fingers crossed it will arrive today because it's meant to arrive today and it, it's a really exciting parcel I've been waiting for since last Friday or Thursday, so it's been a week. <laughs> so yeah, anyway, I am now going to be filming a video because I did get, I think I've, I think I've already showed you, but I am featuring in my beautiful Chanel bag in the video today. Um, because I'm actually filming a Christmas wish list, which you probably have to go up Saturday, it's just gone, I believe, or the one before that anyway. So yeah, yeah, but Scott is going to be on his way soon, so he'll be coming around for tea and stuff, and he might go for like a little walk later on. And yesterday in B and M, I actually bought these things here. I'm just going to show you them because they're so cute. The B and M is actually really good for Christmas decorations. I am going to be putting my tree up very soon, probably at the weekend if if I can be bothered. <laughs> but I've got these are basically a honeycomb tree decorations two for four pounds like a big one and a small one basically scott's mum has these in pink and in like a burgundy color and i really like them obviously this color is gonna look absolutely stunning in my room so when i put in my tree up either tomorrow or saturday i will be um you know putting these up as well i think all i have to do is kind of open them up and just sit them together and then maybe paper clip them so well, that's what i'm gonna do they do have glitter on them so i'm hoping the glitter won't get like on my carpet and stuff that'll be a nightmare but yeah i've also been delving into my roses today oh my god i love them so much i probably have like half a box left it is going down but oh there's anybody else who just love like the packaging of christmas chocolates like it it 
It makes you feel so Christmassy. Like, look at that. Yeah, my parents actually got a Christmas tree yesterday, guys. A oh, real one. Lovely, yeah. Look how big it is. And Scott is here as well. Aren't you? Hi. Yeah, it smells like what when we used to get real ones. It's so nice. Like, it's a really bushy tree it is, it's this year. Yeah. There's one thing that's bugging me. What? What is it? I don't know. Still the bottom bit. Yeah, that's <laughs> you're touching the ground. All yeah. that. No, that can't be else. Is it in water? Yeah. Yeah, of course. It's got to be in water, otherwise, yeah, they can set on fire sometimes. That would be terrible. It would. If we were actually going to be going out on a walk in around 10 minutes, would you say? Walkies. Get Walkies. Your on. Oh no. Get your lead on. But yeah, if we're going to be going on our little walk somewhere. Hey, it can't be helped. I'm only missing. It's something you've done at my house. Hey, look at this photo. Oh, guess how old I am on here, guys. Have a guess. This is when I was in school. I was a 15, so five years. You were 15? Yeah. Look at your makeup. I know. You didn't wear a tie, did you? You, you didn't have to. You didn't have your top button when done. You were... Oh, we had to have our top buttons done and our tie, ties tightened properly. Yeah, the girls we didn't have to wear ties. Anyway, yeah. All the girls protested because they weren't allowed, like, tight pants on. Or... Oh, my God. Yeah, they weren't allowed. And all the old dirty, like... Teachers who work and they were doing this. Uh, that's weird, isn't it? Yeah. Anyway, a change of subject. Uh, we're going to be going on a walk soon, and uh, the parcel has still not arrived, so who knows where it's going to be? I don't know. I'm actually. It's meant to arrive today as well, but it hasn't. What parcel? Yeah, the Huda Beauty parcel. Oh, not another. Not another one. Not another it was on a walk, and there's some cows walking. Oh, oh. I don't they walk too close in case yeah. there is a bull in there. They're so cute. Brown cows, and Scott has his um thingy on again. And I've got my woolly hat on because it's so cold. <laughs> Freezing. I was taking his beauty out today. But yeah. Oh it, it's always cows in here. If you don't know where we are, we're basically in like a little town called Dalston. A little village called Dalston. Oh, I've got my new boots on. Fine, what's that? <laughs> Lovely. Walk in the grass. There's loads of grass there. The one. The joys of being in the countryside, where there's. Oh, look at. Hi. You don't get too close to them, please. I, I get scared of live animals like that. What's going on? Oh, look. They are nice animals. I think it's the red. I think yeah, the grey ones are bullies, it? But welcome to another day. It is a Saturday, and as you can tell, I have my makeup on. I am up bright and early. It's currently 20 to 9, so I am going to be going to work today. Um, you can obviously, I work at the salon as well. I literally work here, there and everywhere at the moment, but you know, I'm ready to go. I have in my PLT, no, is this PLT or Miss Guided? I think it could be PLT actually. A jumper on, it's black, it's cute, it's cropped. And then I also have infra island jeans on because all of you know, the jeans are in the wash. I could really do with like another pair of jeans because a lot of mine are getting like stretched because like, I usually wear Primark. I do have Zara ones and Levi's but the Levi's are really sh like a low rise and I have a really awful ugly belly button that I don't I really want to be sharing with people so yeah but anyway I'm now ready I feel awake all I need to do is gather my bags to go down to work. It isn't raining, but it looks it looks really cloudy and awful. So we'll see. But yeah, I've I've got around four or five people booked in today, and then tomorrow is a busier day with makeup. Tomorrow, today is 
it's more waxing facials which is good yeah, so i've just gotten a delivery from huda beauty and beauty base so i am going to show you what i've got so firstly in the huda beauty parcel i actually got a sample of their water jelly primer i'll have to test that out thank you very much for putting that in um i've never actually had any huda beauty makeup before so i am excited for this then i got three huda beauty foundations let's show you these i got them in the shade angel food what's this one a latte which is like the darkest one and then toasted coconut so these were actually 550 each in the black friday sale and you're thinking 550 each yeah i'm not i know yeah they've now actually gone up to 1320 yeah they're usually 33 pounds so yeah and yeah they're really lightweight foundations as well i love them so much i probably won't be using these for myself i might get away if using this shade this depends on myself but to be honest i, I want to keep them for all my clients so i can kind of show off like my new foundations i've just got they're so nice i'm a 550 you really can't go wrong so that's everything i got from huda beauty just the three foundations honestly i have been waiting since black friday for these to arrive and when they arrived this morning i was so happy it when the parcel man actually knocked on the door i literally jumped out of the couch and Oh, my dad was by the door actually, so he answered the door. But yeah, oh, I'm so excited. Then I actually got from Beauty Bay four of my favourite concealers the Revolution Conceal and Hydrate. Because these are actually $3.50 each for the full sized ones. How good is that? So I've got C2, C3, and C7 and C4. So yeah, these concealers are the best. I love them so much. Yeah, they're so creamy, so easy to blend. Yeah, they're very very high coverage which is what you need in a concealer and yeah, they're really affordable it, it will work so well with every foundation i've used as well then finally i'm i actually got yeah, the beauty bay lip liners i actually got a lip liner quad as it says on the packaging and this was four or five pounds i believe so it's basically got four lip liners in there in different shades i don't actually owned any beauty bay lip liners before so i'm really happy to get these as you can see, let's wait a minute, I'll turn them around. I've got all these shades here. So I've got a pinky one, a nude, a dark nude, and like a really dark, like a pinky purpley colour. So you'll, you'll have to wait and see and see if these work. Oh, they have names on them. This is a vintage. We've got Toast, Whip, and also Heather. That's the shades I've actually got. So yeah, for around... I was trying to think how much this was. 17 so For £37, this is really cheap. I mean, Black Friday, I literally saved my bank account. <laughs> yeah, and I do actually have a PB Weeds parcel on the way. I am actually hoping it'll arrive either today or tomorrow. Otherwise, I will actually be fuming because I'm waiting a week for this now. How satisfying does this look? <laughs> All my lip liners organised into colours. Then all my eyelashes. Look at this. It opens out into more eyelashes. And then all my lipsticks are at the bottom. Like, and then there's all like spare bits and bobs in there. But oh my god. It, it just makes me so happy just having this all organised. It looks so much better. And then I've got all my makeup brushes here. And then all my makeup is inside there. Which I'm sure some people are probably wanting to see what's in here. So I'll show. Look at all them pigments in there. This is a new one, which I love. Look how pretty that is. Then, I've just got, like, all my bases and stuff in there. Then, if we open it out, we've got all my concealers, all my new foundations under there, and then all, like, my usual foundations. So, I've got quite a, a lot of stuff. But, yeah, it's all going to be worth it, because, you know, it's all really good stuff, as I said. But, yeah, that is that. So, it literally is a makeup heaven from... In, in me right now i love it all so much i just have an obsession but yeah look how pretty they are the mum and sister put the tree up last night look how nice it is and a little angel on top we've had this ever since we moved in 15 years so she's 15 years old still going strong but yeah here's a little christmas tree exciting and she's also put a little garland up and 
this is an ugly photo of me from five years ago for school still there and the ugly prom photo and i actually got this card from my family <laughs> a very funny christmas card oh look i've got santa and all these type of stuff and i'm actually going to be bringing some christmas decorations to the salon because i have these fold like trees and they're really cute i will show you them and i've also you can bring some star lights with me but yes i'm going to be going to the salon in 10 minutes but yeah look how pretty the tree is i love it i'm obsessed with my, our little christmas tree this year. well it's not little and it is a real christmas tree it just smells of pine it smells so nice but yeah it does it feel like christmas now officially i'm bringing these into the salon either from being a bargain four pounds i think i might have mentioned them the other day actually but this one you call tree decorations and they're really cute and then the mum actually got some star fairy lights and power man there's obviously some batteries in here that's why i'm just turning like this but yes these are gonna look really cute in the room i'm now home again everyone and as you can tell the only dry bags are showing because i'm tired but yeah basically after work i went home and then i went to my auntie's house to do a makeup because she's going out tonight and she wanted to book in and so as my other auntie she's booked in for tomorrow so yeah i'm having like a pretty good a day with makeup appointments i literally have all makeup appointments tomorrow i think i've got four of them four or five so i'm excited to do the makeup tomorrow which is going to obviously be very very good you know but yeah um so I'll, i'm gonna have a lovely day tomorrow to do makeup is what i'm i'll probably do best out of everything i do out of youtube and my other job you know but yeah i am so thirsty i am gonna have it was my roses because it's basically like my advent calendar because i didn't if you really want an advent calendar there's hardly any left in these now so i'm gonna have one of these i'm thinking go for a golden barrel today because caramel is really nice but yeah i've also been obsessed with this brow gel it's literally from home bargains it is the olivia hill brow gel in shade medium brown i think and oh my god it, it's so good i've used the morphe eyebrow gel before and that like it kind of it, it comes off your eyebrows after a while but this stuff it doesn't it make your eyebrows feel thick of the gel it just kind of goes on nicely and it's a really nice shade on me as well and like i like kind of brushing my eyebrows up to make them look a bit thicker because i do have quite thick eyebrows but yeah, it's really good and this is only 99p and it had them in a light brown and a really dark brown as well. So eyebrow gels are definitely a must have and for 99p you really can't go wrong. So I guess where I'm going in a few days, and probably not actually because the home bargains where I live is actually shocking. It's tiny, but you're meant to be building a bigger home bargain somewhere else like in Carlisle. So yeah, that is a good sign as well but anyway i'm gonna have one of these because they're beautiful mm. hey everybody it's now saturday and i am looking very glam again honestly i've been loving my makeup ever since i've started using this brow gel again where is it gone you know how i showed you all the brow gel i've been obsessed with this one from home park instead of your hair oh my god i feel as if it makes my eyebrows look so thick and bushy but in a nice way and i just like i've been using a new kind of bronzer brush from real techniques and oh my god it is oh it's absolutely amazing it's yeah, this one from home bargains it is so lightweight for a brush and it it makes it easier to, it makes it a lot easier to kind of apply your bronzer on your face and oh my god so pretty i'm obsessed with it but yeah so this morning i woke up at like around half eight to have my breakfast i had a shower did my makeup and stuff um and i am and now i'm gonna be cleaning my own makeup brushes that i use myself because i am going to scott's tonight and i'm actually gonna be doing his mum's makeup tomorrow but i need to do in my own makeup as well because scott has actually got a stall that rhyme scott has actually got he actually has a stall 
at this like barn place and like it's gonna be selling a lot of trick a tray bakes cupcakes all sorts so i'm gonna be helping them out and he's bought a couple of santa hats for us to wear at the store so you know i want to be having a nice makeup on so that i actually look awake and ready to be like serving people uh, yeah and they also have these cute earrings in from asos that he actually got from a birthday in a pack of three how cute are they i love them yeah they're very yeah, they stand out a lot so what i'm gonna do is use some iso clean and clean your brushes because i actually try and clean my brushes every week or every other week it depends how much i wear makeup in the week um because obviously dirty brushes can cause a lot of breakouts on your skin and my skin can break out very easily because of my oily skin and also wearing face masks and stuff it's just getting worse so yeah i've actually been i've actually tried out this Huda beauty primer and i love it i feel as if it's actually made my makeup going a lot smoother today i'm not just saying this because it was a freebie i actually think it is really good yeah and also the beauty foundations that arrived yesterday i am so excited to get like get tried them out and stuff um i'm hoping one of them is going to be in my shade so that i so that i can actually wear it because they look really good but yeah i'm gonna clean my brushes because they the two need clean as you can tell they're very dirty and they nobody likes dirty brushes <laughs> and nobody likes spirit house so yeah and then i'm maybe thinking of curling my hair because why not i'm going to be going to the salon for 12 o'clock because i do have like i'm literally on the go from half 12 until around five half five so i'm i'm literally just gonna have to just get through it all <laughs> it's all makeup appointments today so that's quite good because like i've never had just makeup appointments in one day but because a lot of people are having christmas parties and stuff it's um it's obviously gonna be worth the while but yeah i am really excited to be doing people's makeup today i feel i'm feeling very positive today because most of the time i kind of feel like a meh but i'm I'm actually feeling pretty good today. I am now home after a very, a very busy afternoon and evening, but it my day got better. It went a few Louise, the one out of the two the boxes rise. This is a budget a, a box. It's basically every month a P Louise basically makes up like a budget box and it'll have like seven products in it. Like your new releases, kind of different shades of things and stuff like that. So I am actually going to show you what i've actually got because i am excited it also actually came with like a a scratch card you could you could win like a thousand pounds a hundred pounds and some makeup or something but yeah i did not win so i was quite sad but yeah anyway i'm going to show you what i've got i'm pretty sure you guys are going to want to see what is in there and stuff so yeah so first up i got the cut your own cut carvers this is i think this could be like a new release i think it's like a maybe like a gel type thing i've not opened it yeah, but how good is the packaging for a start because that's the first thing i got i also got a going solo palette honestly this palette is stunning and the packaging she always wins so basically it's in the style of a cassette you know if you're old enough to remember what the cassettes are luckily i still remember even though i was a 2001 baby if we used to still have them when i was little but that's in the style of a cassette and if you don't know what one is basically it played music it's basically like an older version of a cd and you just have to put it into our cassette player anyway enough of me boring you guys about cassettes it's a going solo palette honestly this palette is a perfect smoky eye palette look how pretty that palette is I'm obsessed with it it is so pretty and i am definitely going to be using that soon that is so stunning then i've actually got acid rain in it river i have been wanting one of these for ages and it's such a good color as well so i'm really happy about this color i also got an eyeshadow brush in 198 yeah, look how cool it is it has like bits of gold in it it'll be a really good eyeshadow brush definitely and then i also got a stay shining 
I think it's a lip gloss. It's in the shade Iradiant Soul. It's a really good colour. Um, and I've opened it and it's so nice. I'm not going to open it again though, but look, look how good the packaging is. Then a mini eyebrow pencil, which I have not opened in espresso. And then finally, I got the P. Louise Basic Cosmetics Base in a really orange colour. A yellow, a yummy yellow. I actually have a few of these bases and they are really good. So I'm definitely going to be adding a few things to my kit tonight or today, whatever. Um, so yeah, I am really, really, really happy with the things I've got. And now I'm going to have to clean in my makeup brushes because I actually did go and do my auntie's makeup. Honestly, I am so dehydrated. I have not had a drink since around 12 o'clock. Yeah, so I've got a lot of photos to upload on my Instagram. I just have a lot of things to do tonight, to be honest. And then it was actually ordered me like a dress for Christmas, which I'm going to have to try on. I'm also going to Scott's tonight. I don't know if I've already mentioned, but I'm going to Scott's house, so I will be going to his tonight. I'm basically picking Bonnie up, my sister, from her work, and then after like, I've dropped her off, I'll be going straight home again. Uh, not straight home, straight to Scott's house. I'll be doing his mum's makeup in the morning as well, so I've got to make sure that everything is kind of, you know, done and dusted for that and all clean. So, yes, I'm excited to add a few of these things into my... A makeup box which is actually overflowing with makeup at the moment i think i'm going to keep this for myself because i feel as if you need to kind of keep something for yourself and this is definitely something i'm going to use it's perfect smoky eye palette which i love so yes i'm definitely going to try that out very 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 soon here's the stall look all this stuff we've got look. <laughs> i want a bit of that is it, is it all Cute. the cookie pie there was? No, there's more. They're cooking though. There was more. Is yeah. Look how cute it is. All ready to go now. A very professional high five. <laughs> Time for an Indian, guys, after our good day at the store. And Dave is here now to join us. She's with her tea as well. But yes. She said what? Dave's just had her tea. But yes, we're having an oh. Indian now. And we'll have some Prosecco soon so yes oh, i'm excited on, film on yeah, yeah film on Polar everything express. like that yeah for express oh my bloody god jeez i look so tired and like it's such a mess right now but i am home i drove home from scott's house this morning and i am now going to be getting ready for work so that means i am actually going to end this vlog here so if you guys have enjoyed this vlog Please make sure to leave a thumbs up, comment down below, also subscribe, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye, everybody.